Welcome in to another Musings from the Mount of Tutorial, where we're just going to take a quick look at something fun we can do with particles, where we can make them change size over time in the sample you can see on the screen. They get smaller uh, as they rise, almost like this could be a beaker that was bubbling, and they get smaller as the bubbles dissipate. We can flip it over and make them uh, get, uh, you know, go the other direction. If it was a situation where we're doing like low poly smoke or something like that. So the real quick, uh, easy setup for this is we'll just start with a blank slate. We're going to add two things. We're going to add a mesh plane uh, in our case as the emitter. And then we're going to do a mesh icosphere as the particle object. So let's, with the plane selected, let's click on here and create a new particle system. And what we're going to do is I'm going to change this to about 150 particles. So it kind of slowly bubbles. I'll change my end time to 250, my lifetime to 100. So we have more time to kind of see these uh, bubbles uh, change size. We're going to change uh, render to object. We're going to select the icosphere. Uh, and I am going to scale this to 0.15 so we can kind of see this i'm also going to jump down here to gravity to um, get these guys to rise like this and so now that we've kind of got our particle system set up uh, the way we want it uh, we're going to add that uh, size changing effect so i'm in eevee um, and i'm going to go down to textures i'm going to add a new texture i'm going to click on this button to go to textures i am going to change to blend mode and then I, under mapping, I am going to change from generated to strand particle. Under influence, uh, I'm going to uncheck time. And I am going to check size. And you'll see by default, it is smaller and getting bigger. And so we can control this by adding a color ramp. And as you can see, we can adjust the color ramp to see you know where it gets bigger or larger uh, by adjusting each end. And you know by default, the particles get bigger as they get further away from the emitter, and all we have to do is flip this uh, color ramp, and now the bubbles get uh, smaller as they go up. And so, whichever way you'd like to implement this, this is how you uh, change the size of particles uh, as they uh, live their life. I hope this was helpful. Until the next time.